really really good that we had that um, we've we've had the cameras for a while but we just um, pretty much like installed them and put them up or whatever so because you know Sean's mom was staying with us in the basement and then my mom came and stayed for two weeks or two and a half weeks to help me out so we didn't have a need to really have them in the basement and you know we were there and stuff like that so now that we're gonna be out of the home and she's gonna be in the care of someone else um, we have them installed so Sean could not wrap his hand, his head around having someone that he doesn't know watch his child, which it was hard for me too, don't get me wrong. It was very, very hard for me. I think what made it a little easier for me is the fact that um, she had her own child and she was bringing her child with her. And so I just felt like, you know, it, it wouldn't have been uh, a bad situation. I was willing to give it a shot. I'm, I'm gonna put it that way. So I was willing to give it a shot. But Sean couldn't wrap his head around it. So last night um, he went to his cousin's house, and then um, one of his people pretty much offered to uh, babysit Rain for us. So it works out um, for multiple reasons. So we're pretty much like helping her too, and she's helping us. So. I'm, I'm comfortable with it. I don't know her, so um, for her to watch Rain is no different feeling-wise than the young lady that we had initially hired to watch Rain for me because I don't know her. But because Sean does, it makes it a little easier on me and it makes it a lot easier on him. Y'all know Sean is very, very adamant on what he believes or whatever. And it's his first child, so it's okay. <laughs> Oh my god, this stuff like this is funny and that's why I'm like, I'm glad I vlog so I can like have these memories to look back on because naturally I always turn one way when I'm on like this one road by my house. Naturally, because like everything we do, we very rarely go to the right. So I always go left, naturally. And so um, I went the way that I always normally go I'm sitting here running my mouth talking to y'all and I'm in the back I, I hear in the back seat I hear and this little girl back there chomping down that dad on pacifier and I'm thinking like while I'm, while I'm vlogging like what is that noise and then it hit me like oh my god my damn daughter's in the back I'm not taking her to work <laughs> I gotta go pick up the dad on set up so yeah y'all and then I had to turn around and that was a good little ways too not too too far thank god but I definitely it definitely added 10 more minutes to my drive so <clears throat> I don't have to be to work until 10 so hopefully um it's like not it's like 8 20 right now so hopefully I can get to her and get back to the house at least by 8 50 as long as I leave out the house by like 9 10 I should be good because y'all know I'm not used to like having a drive to work so I can't really guesstimate how the traffic's gonna be I don't really know how it is around this hour or nothing so I gotta figure it out though y'all I just gotta knock it out three days this week three days next week and then I'm gonna tell my supervisor hopefully I'm good to go and I can just you know go back to work from home because the um, protocol with my job is when you're out more than 30 days um, you have to come back into the office for like retraining or whatever um, for 30 days just to catch up on, you know, new policies, procedures, whatever. 
refresh you and then also some systems may kick you out like i've been kicked out the billing system or whatever so i have to get my um user id reset and all that so that's the typical protocol but my supervisor is real cool and she was like you know if you um, feel like you're good to go back home and you want to leave um the office earlier in 30 days just let me know so i was like okay so i'm gonna you know definitely put forth the effort and take in everything i can take in so i feel like i've been doing the job for six years now my six year anniversary was february 18th so um i definitely feel like i can um you know i'll be good at least after you know the second week since i'm only doing three days a week i work now monday through wednesday and i'm off on thursdays and fridays so yeah i manifested that to y'all but yeah, everything's coming full circle. You know what I'm saying? I'm very, very thankful and blessed. Um, so when I get back home, I'm going to finish getting um, everything, you know, that the sitters are going to need for rain. I really wanted to do all of this last night, so I didn't have to do any of this this morning. But y'all know how that went with her. She was so fussy and colicky, and it kind of knocked out a couple hours. So by the time I was done dealing with her and Sean came home, I just had enough time to go back downstairs, finish making the tuna fish for Sean, and then uh, pack my lunch. So, y'all, we'll see how the first day goes. I'll let you guys know. Um, I probably, of course, won't vlog, vlog much today because I'll be at work, but on my breaks and stuff like that, when I check in with Brain and everything, I'll be, um, I'll vlog. So, I will talk to you guys in a bit. <sighs> all right y'all i'm on a roll so i'm definitely behind schedule but i feel like i pretty much missed the morning rush i'm hoping i haven't hit the highway yet but it's 9 20. um i just got the babysitter all set up so of course as soon as we walk in the door sean is on the camera talking and um so i did you know she knew about it he told her already about the camera so i let her know it's two-way audio so she could talk back he could talk to her or whatever but yeah, I get a good vibe from her. And like I said, you know, it's family to Sean. So I, she's in good hands. Um, but yeah, so now I'm headed to work. I was able to make my breakfast smoothie. I was afraid I wasn't gonna have enough time, but I made time. Um, so yeah, it's uh, the strawberries, oranges, banana, and a little bit of orange juice. So that's what I'm having for breakfast. And oh my God, you guys, I left my lunch. I have to turn around for that. How did I do that? I'm moving too fast today. Now I'm gonna be late to work. Yeah. I definitely left my lunch. Oh, maybe I could just, I'm just gonna keep going to work because I can't afford to be late. I don't wanna be late my first day back. It's already 9.23. I'm gonna just call her and have her um, put my lunchbox in the fridge. It's okay. It's, okay. it's gonna happen, you know. I've been out of the loop for a while. I haven't had to pack lunch in forever. So, it's a given. I took it out on the counter and then left it um, on the counter, so. I'm gonna call her and ask her if she could put it in the fridge for me. Darn it. So I'm on my first break, y'all. I'm ready to go home. <sighs> my phone's charging. I literally been like just sitting here talking. I'm I'm doing a side by side, so I'm sitting with someone, but it's just I know the content, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just kinda just sitting watching someone take calls that I've been taking for six years now. So <sighs> time isn't really going by as fast as I would like, but it's going. But anyway, I just wanted to just jump on and say hi to you guys. I did get some pretzels for a snack and I made it with some cheese. So, I'll jump back in the pew. Yeah, finishing up my lunch break. I was chilling in the car, eating and talking to my coworker. Whew, I'm ready to go. I haven't done a 10 hour shift in so long. Like, I think July. So this is like completely okay throwing my ass off. And I'm like, what in the world? I just keep telling myself two more days and then you got four days off. 
But yeah, I'm about to go back into my job. Oh God, I'm so tired. <sighs> Sean just called. He's running one errand and he gonna go home and grab the babysitter and take her home. I looked on the camera and I see Kaden on his phone, which he should not be. So I told Sean to um, tell Kaden to do his homework. Cause my phone's about to die. It's probably dead now, but yeah. So anywho, I'm about to go back in this job. I'll probably come back out to the car later cause I still got some leftovers of my lunch. So, Alright, I'll talk to y'all in a bit. You guys, I'm home hey. with my boo-boo. Hey, boo-boo. Hey, mama. <laughs> Doing her baby push-ups, y'all. She gonna be out of this little bass in that. Look how long she is. Huh? <laughs> you practicing holding that head up, boo? Hi, <laughs> mama. So cute. So I made it through the day, y'all. Home sweet home, sweet home Alabama. You gonna speak? Don't mean my vlog not speaking. He always give y'all a dry crying or something. <sighs> I'm about to go downstairs and make a um a smoothie you said you ate i'm sorry i'm about to eat my left over from lunch i didn't even uh i didn't even touch my salad i got because i'm like i like my salad cold and my dressing and the dressing wasn't cold and then the salad was out all day so i'm picky when it comes to certain things I like my salad and my salad dressing coat. I don't like no warm ass lettuce. All right, boo boo, I'm about to pick you up. Let me get her, y'all. Get my boo boo. Good morning, happy Tuesday. So I am getting myself ready to head out in a few and go pick up the sitter. I'm writing currently. I'm writing in my gratitude journal. Baby girl is not asleep, but she's laying down. Cadence downstairs loading the dishwasher. About to head off to school. And then um, when I get back from getting her, I'm gonna run in and blend up my breakfast smoothie, grab my lunch this time, cause I forgot it yesterday, and head to work. So I just wanted to just jump on and say good morning to you guys. Hey, boo boo. Good morning. Good morning, boo boo. together so I can go downstairs with her. Alright, so me and baby girl are on our way to get the sitter. Um, it's wet outside today. It's drizzling. It's not really like raining hard or anything, but it's definitely wet, so hopefully um, there won't be any traffic on my way in. So, but I pretty much got everything. Um, she didn't, um, she didn't change like have to change rain in any different like clothes or anything so i washed her down this morning and changed her and um, put her in a clean onesie and, and so she still has like two changes of clothes downstairs from yesterday that she didn't um, use so if she needs to change her they'll be down there and then everything else, of course, diapers and wipes and everything is already set. So I have two bottles made. I'm going to go in because I forgot that I had this one in my purse um, from last night in the room. So I'm going to make that one. Oh, my God. It's going to take me forever to get out of this. Ugh, this is so frustrating. But anyway, so it might be some traffic this morning. So if I can't make my smoothie, then I'm going to have to probably stop and get one. I probably... um. Yeah, I'll probably just have to go straight to work if I if I feel like I'm running late and then I'll just um, leave on my first break and get one. Come on, Ryan. Work with mommy, boo-boo. 
I can't be reaching back there giving you that passy. So yeah, y'all, I just wanted to just jump on let you guys good morning. And um, I don't know if Rain's gonna be fussy today or not. I feel like I just fed her, and uh, I feel like right now she probably wants to lay back down. So I'll let the sitter know that she might want um, the rest of her bottle or um, to lay her down. Let's see what this is. Definitely gonna be probably late or borderline late today because traffic is crazy it's almost as if everybody called out yesterday being this it, yesterday was monday and now everyone's coming in today on top of the fact that it's wet out here so it is what it is y'all it is what it is but i did um my play i did make my breakfast smoothie so I got that, and I'll probably, um, since I'm gonna be late anyway, I probably will just stop at uh, McDonald's and get a hash brown. I just need a little something on my, my stomach. But, all right, yesterday was um, no carb day. So yesterday all I really had was wings, um, some celery and carrots. And I had a salad that I had brought from the store but I like my salad cold, like I said. So I have that in the fridge for tonight. Um, and then I had fruit, a fruit salad yesterday morning. So I did pretty good yesterday. So today I actually can have some carbs. So I think I'm gonna do a hash brown <sighs> with the smoothie. And then I brought my lunch. Um, I brought my lunch that I forgot, which has, what's in my lunch y'all? I forgot what's in the day on lunch. I have a few plantains. Oh, plantains. I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm not even I have plantains, um, sauteed peppers and onions, and the um, baked chicken breast that Sean made. I was gonna put some barbecue sauce on it, but I'm like, nope. I don't want to do the barbecue sauce. He actually made. Um, he put. He made like a sauce and put it on for Caden last night for dinner and I had a little piece of that when I came home and it was real good. But I was like, no, I don't want to do the sauce because I'm trying to just cut back everywhere I can. I'm just trying to cut back on all the unnecessary, you know, stuff that I do, which is like the sweet sauces and all that. So I'm not going to do the sauce. I'm going to just put the peppers on it, cut it up, and eat it like that. So we're moving now, y'all. I guess it was because it was this car broke down, so I might not be late after all, but it's still nasty out here. day okay and I'm not even actually doing my daggone job I'm like doing testing testing I'm not testing trainings and stuff like online modules and then sitting with someone doing side by sides and I feel mentally drained like I'm tired I'm so tired but I'm not gonna complain it's just I'm out of the loop I'm just out of the rhythm you know of working I'm just used to just being home and you know being with my baby so one more day y'all that's how I look at it I'm like all right well you just suck it up for three days even though these three days feel so long they feel like five days and that's because I work 10 hours but I'm like you know what something's better than nothing and this check is gonna be better than your daggone disability check. So I just keep, you know, giving myself mental notes like, all right, <sighs> one more day. So yeah, I got through today, y'all. Got through today. And I know like the vlogs aren't gonna be anything, you know, because one, y'all gonna see me majority in the house, I mean, in the car. And then when I get home, it's brief, you know, I'm gonna let y'all, you know, see rain, Kaden and Sean, but I don't really 
really got much going on, y'all, because I've been at work. But it's all good. It's all good. You know, stuff like this just motivates me to, like, you know, do more outside of work so I can put myself in position to get paid for what I want to do and not for what I have to do. Like, straight up, I'm manifesting that, okay? That's what I'm manifesting. And y'all know my little manifestation journal is like my damn genie in the bottle. So I'm like, well, if everything else can come to me, why can't that? You know, it might take a little longer, more work or whatever, but I'm gonna get it done. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to get on the road, so I'll hit you guys when I get home. Yeah, but I figure she probably wants some um, cups and stuff to drink out of. Say what it did. With the business here. They want to know when we get in the blind check. Yeah, every time we go to the store, we're going to be thinking about the damn blinds. I'm, it's not until I start vlogging. I look in the back like, why? Trying to head battling flies over the summer. But anyway, y'all, um, let me see if she's asleep. I've been home for like an hour. I'm going to get my baby Hayden already went to bed. My boo boo. her, changed her, gave her her little gripe water. Now she knocked out. Hey, mama. So, anyway, I'm about to relax because I'm tired. So, I'm getting ready to load this dishwasher. <clears throat> and Sean must have forgot to make my rice. Hey, you got to call me in the house. Oh, I thought you knew when I was going to be on I know we got the cameras in the house. So I'll be stalking on Sean I might be watching her. With Raymond. I'll be watching you. What? As soon as I come downstairs in the morning, you on there. Y'all, as soon as I come down the steps, he be busting through. Except he talk. I don't say nothing. I just check in real quick and then I see that they home and I'll be like, alright. Because I can't really have my phone out. Look. If you had the uh, home off, like just home off, and you got the home. Yeah, then they alert you when yeah, movement. As soon as the movement alert my phone, you know what Yeah. Oh, shit. I put it on huh? our way. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I put it on the way when they left. I was like, okay, they gone. Left the lights on downstairs and everything. Still running up some damn bills. Anyway, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog because at this point, y'all done got, what, Monday? Today's Tuesday night. I was going to come by on Wednesday, but ain't nothing going on Wednesday. Same drive, same drive into work. <sighs> so, I'm not trying to bore y'all to death. So, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. Thank you for watching. Come on, Sean. I ain't doing nothing like that, don't you? I'll be acting like your hand wasn't going for the lens. Thank you for. <clears throat> Thank you for. Stop squeezing. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you don't miss when we upload another. Okay. Oh. See y'all in the next video.